how to make ebook website in google sites hello and welcome to our channel on this video i'm going to show you how you can make ebook website in google sites so please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial but before that if you don't know what's google sites it is a user-friendly web-based platform developed by google designed for creating and publishing websites without requiring any coding skills in which it has become an integral part of Google Workspace, allowing seamless integration with other Google applications such as Docs, Drive, and Calendar, and users can create a variety of websites ranging from personal blogs to collaborative project hubs through a simple drag-and-drop interface, making it accessible for individuals and organizations alike. So now to start, you simply go to this sites.google.com, and from here it will show you that you can start creating from blank site or scratch, or you could also choose a variety of template in here in this template gallery but in this option i'm going to choose to start from scratch or blank site so i'm going to click this one and as you can see it is basically how you can start doing it you can start entering here the name and i just enter here ebook store but you could also enter the site name in here if you want to you could also change the background of this website and also insert some of the details on the right side panel or editing tools but in generating an ebook website on Google Sites, we're going to use some other platform which is called this one is Stripe.com, in which it is a leading technology company that provides payment processing solution and financial infrastructure for businesses globally. So from here, all you need to do is to simply sign in your account, and after that, it will show you on the left side panel some of the options to navigate. But in those options, can you proceed by clicking these payment links or this share a payment links button right here? And you could also find it under this payment option and by clicking the start button from here the next thing that you need to do is to simply select here either products or subscriptions now under this payment page you simply enter here add a new product and after that on this pop-up window you simply enter here the name of your product but at this point i'm going to enter here ebook and below here you could also enter the description and upload the files or the cover photo of your ebook in here and in generating an ebook cover photo we could also use this kind of platform so just simply sign in your account and go to the search bar then you search for ebook template and upon searching on it it will show you in here a variety of templates that you can choose from that is also offer for free but some of those templates are offer or you must have an upgrade account to use it or pro account in here but in those options i'm going to choose this one that i've already created so from here we can start clicking on it to start customizing it such as the font, the font style, the text, and many more. And on the left side panel, we can navigate these elements, graphic design, text, and other editing tools in here. And if you're now done navigating and customizing your template in here to save the changes, you simply click the share button on the top right corner. And after that, you'd also download this as PNG or JPG. But at this point, I'm just going to download this as PDF standard or PDF print and click download to proceed. And after that, the next thing that we need to do is to simply go back to this page of our Stripe account and just simply upload under these images the JPG or the PNG file of our ebook cover photo that we just customized in our Canva account. So you can simply upload from your computer files and you will be able to see here the result of it. So this is basically what it looks like. And below you could also enter the quantity in here on the right side panel. And you could also enter the amount required in here and choose the kind or your preferred currency in here now for instance i'm going to enter here one unit or one quantity amounting to 99.99 .99 us dollar you would also start collecting tax if you want to but at this point i'm not going to apply that one now to proceed you could also select here either one off or recurring but at this point i'm going to click one off and proceed by clicking add product button to proceed and after adding a product of our ebook in here, the next thing that you need to do is to simply fill out the required information also that you can add here. But it will show you on the right side panel what it looks like. And under this option section, you could also collect customer address if you want to, or require customer to provide a phone number, limit the number of payments. And under this advanced options, you could also allow promotion codes, add a custom fields, allow business customer to provide tax IDs, and many more. But now to proceed, under this after payment option, under this show confirmation page, you can also replace the default with custom messages by simply checking or clicking these boxes. And from here, let's say I'm going to enter thank you for purchase. 
and at this point we could also select here or paste the link that contain the file of our ebook in which the customer can access once they send the payment or purchase our product so at this point i'm going to enter here here's the link to access the ebook and after that at this point we're going to upload here the link in here and in uploading a link we're going to also use some other platform or this google drive in which it also offer for free so all you need to do is to click the new button in here and click the file upload and simply choose to upload a pdf file of our ebook that we are selling in our website and after simply uploading the file in here it will automatically show us that it will be reflected on this point now as you can see it is now currently being uploaded so the next thing that we need to do is to click the three dots right here and in this pop-up window just select share button and click share once again and after that on this pop-up window under this general access kind of click this restricted and choose anyone with the link in which it has here a viewer as an access and we could also simply copy the link and after copying the link just simply go back to this page and paste it in here so as you can see it is now currently pasted now below you could also add the post payment invoice but it will show us in here what it looks like on the right side panel so this is basically what the customer will see once they send the payment or purchase our ebook wherein they can start clicking the link and they will be directed to the file that they can access and now to proceed just click the create link button on the top right corner and upon doing so it will show us in here that the link is now being created below it will show us the overview including the payment methods the payment analytics and many more but to start proceeding or copying the code to our google site just click this buy button right here and it will show us in here the embed code that we can simply click this copy code button to proceed and after that just simply go back to our google sites in here and on the right side panel under insert kind of click this embed option in which by clicking on it just simply click on this pop-up window embed code and paste it the code that we just copy and after that just proceed by clicking the next button below here to proceed and click the insert once again then it will show us in here what it looks like so as you can see we've here the ebook that we are currently selling and you could also adjust the size of it and the location of it depending on your preferences so as you can see we've now successfully add here our ebook button to purchase in our google sites while on the right side panel you could also start navigating to add a pages themes such as to customize the design the layout of our website in here you could also add here different kind of elements under this insert button such as different kind of content blocks button divider spacer and many more but to proceed just click the publish button on the top right corner to publish this website but overall that is just basically who you can make ebook website in google sites thank you